What's going on YouTube modeling community? Pappy here at West Georgia Rods and Customs. Good Monday evening. Hope everyone's having a wonderful start to the work week as well as the 4th of July holiday. Thought I'd start out this week by doing a video uh, as far as I'm having kind of a change of direction. My old buddy over there across the pond, O. Al Woods with Al Woods Modeling Mayhem. He's hosting the group bill for my buddy Jeff Canelli, old ferret boy over at Jeff's Model Car Garage. Uh, I threw my hat in the ring on this and was going to build the uh, AMT Cam uh, El Camino. Well, I've had a little change of direction. I kind of been wanting to build that El Camino in a different direction than, you know, painting it brown or something like that. So, with that being said, what am I going to do? What am I going to build from old buddy Jeff? Hmm. He sure did speak highly of this kit right here, though. When he built the crew chief kit, the AMT kit, man, he said this thing went together just so perfectly. He enjoyed it. He's going to build another one. Not. <laughs> he said this kit was it was a thorn in his side, biggest pain in the ass that he ever seen. So he really, he really, he said he was never going to build this kit again, even though I not, think he's got one in his stash. But me, myself, I've built this kit before. I, ne I really didn't build it exactly like this as a four drive i built it as a slammer i'll show y'all what i did with mine if many of you follows my channel i did this one as a as a slam low rider uh kind of a convertible blah 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 you know but anyhow i've been wanting to build a big four wheel drive again uh i built a big four wheel drive out of the uh, gmc uh can't remember i think it was a snowplow kit but i put the lifted suspension the big tires and the whole nine yards so I've been wanting to build the uh, build a blazer in the same fashion. Set it up real tall, put the big tires on it, big lift kit. Uh, what else? Roll bar, mm, custom interior. What better one to do it with? Take some of the pieces out of that one. I may use the frame. I'm not 100% sure yet as far as what I'm going to do with it. Uh, I do want to use the suspension, possibly the frame uh, out from this kit but uh the only thing really i will use i'll probably use the frame i'm not 100 percent sure i'd like to keep the same i don't want to have to shorten that frame so i may wind up with this frame and using the suspension and maybe the engine out of it nah i think i'm gonna use a big block i'm sure i got a big block somewhere around this around this shop somewhere but uh i think there will be a big big fat motor in this one lifted up big high with them big big old monster motors on there and and a good, I might do, I know it's got a, uh, I know it's got a lift kit on it, but I think I might even do a little uh, body body lift on it as well as suspension lift. And thinking about maybe building a custom roll bar, using a lot of big lights on top. Yeah, can't wait to get that thing started. But this is what I'm gonna build for my buddy, Jeff. Uh, one of the things I'm gonna do, of course it's gonna, I think about doing it in a two-tone. Uh, this, uh, probably doing this in a black, uh, maybe the bottom trim right here, uh, maybe a gray, silver, somewhere, you know, somewhere in that avenue, so be a silver, use it, do the, uh, chrome accent down through here, and then do this black, and this up in here, do it as a gray also. So, but using them big old tires out from under that, man, I can't wait to get started. But uh, Jeff, I, I, got, I was talking to Jeff. I know Jeff real well. He, he said that this kit was a big pain in the butt. And when I built it, here's, here's what I did with mine. I kind of did a, went a different direction with it. And there's what I did. I just kind of slammed mine on the ground, put the big old, uh, put the big tires on it like that. And, but that was a fun build. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna change, do a little, I'll probably do a custom, you know, interior and all that change the seats who knows but uh that's what i'm planning on building for jeff this is going to be my tribute to my old buddy jeff sicconelli i want to try to get this thing finished before november i think al said that the uh, deadline's in december of this year so i've got plenty of time to get it finished as well but uh here we go jeffro this is going to be i'm going to build this for you you can haul them little hairy varmints around in the back of this thing and have, have just have all kind of fun but uh there you go this is gonna be what i built for old jeff rose ain't gonna be an el camino it's got to be tall it's got to be chrome got to be black and man i tell you what it's gonna have a big block in it can't think of a better person to build it for jeff 
Hope you enjoy this. I'll give you all updates on it as I get started. I got one sitting in front of it right now that I'm, uh, I'm probably going to do a video on it here in a few minutes. Uh, I want to get this one finished and I'm going to get started on this one. But I'll show y'all what I'm going to be working on here just in a few minutes on the next video. So stay, stay tuned. I'll show you what, uh, what else is on the bench. But there you go. Al, Jeff, this is what I'm doing. Remember guys, if you can dream it, build it. God bless y'all. Pack it out.